Okay, so when you call 911, you expect someone on the other end to send help. Well, WREL has learned in at least one recent instance, Durham EMS did not have an ambulance available to respond to a crash scene. WREL's Monica Casey talked to the EMS chief to find out why. Broadcastify radio traffic shows a back and forth between dispatchers and first responders on a busy Tuesday night. Engine one, ops two, ops two, no medic available. Durham EMS Chief Mark Lockhart tells me an EMS supervisor was first to arrive on Holloway Street where two people were shot. An ambulance arrived three minutes later. A Durham police officer responding to the shooting was involved in a crash with another vehicle nearby. We'll keep one medic unit with you, and then I need the other medic unit to attend Holloway and Hyde Park. Chief Lockhart told me no ambulances were available, but an EMS supervisor did respond, and an ambulance was diverted from the shooting to the crash. This isn't the first time there haven't been ambulances available for emergencies in Durham. Less serious 911 calls had to be put on standby in July of 2022 and again in August. Chief Lockhart tells me last summer there were 25 vacancies. He says 11 recruits started in an academy on Monday and the department now has 18 open positions. Chief Lockhart tells me this is a function of increased demand versus supply, essentially being stretched thin. Monica Casey, WRL News in Durham. And the chief added a shift commander and two lieutenants are in SUV units responding to calls as paramedics throughout the night. And